Do you have breakfast? No, Joe, I actually never eat breakfast. No, that was I a don't. lie. I apologise. Ah, you're a talc boy and you don't have breakfast. Yep. No, nope, can't eat first thing, feel sick. Yeah, same. I don't yep. eat. I eat an earlier lunch than most people. Yeah, yeah. What time do you have your lunch? It depends often, about sort of 11 ish. Yeah! Yeah! Oh. We're practically Blood Brothers now. This is amazing. Yeah! Let's yeah. actually be Blood Brothers, then we'll both have a hepatitis. <laughs> That's what we're doing yeah, this week. We're going to yeah. cut our <laughs> We're going to do something which um, Stuart is very uh, famed for, which is eating weird shit. What's the worst thing you've ever eaten? Uh, there was a bottle of Cresta from the 70s. Oh, I, tried I think recently. I saw that. That had little yeah. bits floating in it. It was bad. It tastes like terps. Somebody who used to work for Cresta got in touch and said it had milk as a fairly major ingredient of Cresta. Cresta? Yes, but it wasn't fizzy. And remember, it's foamy, not fizzy. Yeah. That's why, apparently. And the milk over time breaks down into something much chemically like terps. Wow. So I regret the second bowl. Shruddy man. Was it Cresta or was it Corona? Which one had the bubbly bottles? Uh, that's Corona. Ah. Yeah, because that was, let's get physical. See what yeah, I remember there. that. And Cresto yeah. was his frothy man. Frothy man. Wasn't there a, a, a polar bear? The, that yes, with it's, cool shades. It's frothy yeah. man. Like yeah. That. Yeah. See, you My get all the God. reference, kids. Hey, this is the trouble. We're all getting old. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're back. Anyway, so weird things to eat. So we're going to sample some crisps from around the world. Do you want to start with a sweet or savoury crisp? Let's start with a savoury and then we can go on to desserts. Well, let's, let's try savoury Pringles. These okay. are an Aussie favourite. Now, I'm going to ask my wife about this, being an Aussie. Meat platters. No, meat pie. Yeah, I know that, <laughs> I know that says meat pie. Right. What's going on already? <laughs> meat pie, right? This is meat pie flavour Pringles. Now, uh, do people win meat in pubs in Australia? I think so, yeah. What's that about? I don't know. Like a load of raw meat in a pub? Yeah. As a prize? Yeah. You Have you heard of this? Pub? Yes, weirdly, we reference it in uh, Plibius, the film. Near the oh. end, as a sort of Jared Christmas nod, is from New Zealand. We mentioned there's a pub quiz and that the prize is a big tray of meat. Well, there you go. Yeah. Lovely. How strange. Yeah. But you would have thought that... We'd have put jokes in instead of weird references <laughs> to Australian <laughs> customs. Who needs jokes? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Something weird happened to me once with some raw meat. Oh, yeah. Right, I'm looking forward to this one. <laughs> I used to work with this guy who I think was a psychopath. Nice. Um, I've got a lot of stories about him. His name was... I'm not going to say it. <laughs> uh, That was probably a wise decision. And he, he, uh, he announced suddenly one day that he was quitting work and he didn't tell anyone what it was about. And he was acting very weird about the reasons for quitting. Anyway, we had we organised his leaving drinks, by which point it announced that he wasn't leaving anymore. Um, That's because, the best kind of leaving yeah, drinks. Because yeah. the, the situation had been resolved. But when we got to the pub, we all sat in a circle, a bunch of us. There were all these... I can't say where I worked either. This is... <laughs> this is difficult because there was a certain type of person that was there. So can can not... you give us a fictional character who would be the same sort of person? Member of status quo. Gotcha. They looked like members of status quo, right? Okay. And one yeah. of these members of status quo, not really a member of status quo, uh, handed this guy a clear plastic bag full of lumps of meat and said, I've got your meat. And he went, oh, and pull it under his chair. And it was, no, it was it. It just kept under his chair for the duration of the leaving drinks. This is like the special meat from League of Gentlemen. Yeah, or something, it was exactly it? like that. I was so weirded Ooh. out, and I didn't. But I was kind of too weirded out to kind of go. Well, you got a load of raw meat under his chair. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that doesn't seem like a normal thing. Shall we try right. meat pie flavour? You put me off a bit now, but let's go for it. Looks like it's got ketchup on it. Oh God, ketchup on a pie. Don't like that. No, it's really good. Ketchup uh, on a pie, yeah. good. I don't know. I don't want ketchup with the gravy. Ketchup is a bit no, sweet, no isn't gravy. it? No. Oh, but there's gravy in the pie, surely. Oh, can you get the crunch? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The crunch. Oh. We've got crunch. You're, You're going to lead like it with this. some animal, some honking, <laughs> shrieking creature on the lead. Yeah. Ah, kill me. Ah. Crunch. Crunch. The bloody saucy sauce. It's it's a mix Tautology. of, of well. ketchup. Yeah, I'll show it to the camera. 
eats, makes a ketchup and ranch oh dressing. Oh God, ranch dressing! That really you sweet know, like stuff. Ranch. Oh, I'm I can't do, deal with that. This morning. Oh, oh, it's just man. like sugar with a hint of salad. It's awful. Well, it smells like Thousand Island dressing. Mm. Yeah, it does actually. It tastes like Thousand Island dressing. Oh, maybe that's what Thousand Island dressing has been all along. Yeah, it only comes from two islands: Ketchup Island and Ranch <laughs> Island. <laughs> A ranch on Ketchup Island. Yeah. Crunch. Uh, there you go. Crunch. Right. Sorry, well, we digress. <laughs> ah, actually, that's not bad. Crunch. <laughs> right. Sponsored by Crunch. Mmm. Get your three I a just day of crunch. There's a lot of Heinz stuff on this table. It doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah. It's a lot of Heinz. If Tom Baker does an <laughs> ad for Heinz next week, you are in trouble. <laughs> okay, here we go. Do you like Pringles? I do. I call them citronella. Do you know what citronella is? Uh, that's like, is that a cleaning product? It's a, no, it's a, a smell. What is it? It's a... It's, it's like an essential oil. It's essential oil, but you exactly. have it during barbecues to keep mozzies and flies off, mm. off of the oh, food. Oh, yeah, away some from with the you. Guests. Yep. So, uh, family gatherings, I always get some Pringles because I don't like them. And I call them citronella because it keeps the kids off of my crisps. Oh. So, <laughs> so you don't like any of the flavours of Pringles? I don't know. They're all right. I just find the texture a bit cardboardy. Would you like to I can understand meat pie? Oh, these look a bit different to our local so Pringles. Aussie, Aussie Pringles. Smaller. Um, a little bit more pallid. Smells of barbecue beef flavour crisps. That's all I'm getting. Oh. Not really. Get, it's like a subtle beef flavour. Yeah. There is a tang of sweetness to it. Is that the ketchup? That must be the ketchup. Mmm. Well, mm, not liking those much. I don't like the aftertaste of the sweetness. Yeah, I'm not a big mm. fan. No. Meat pie flavour. They're all right. But Send them back nothing, under. Nothing. No, that's not good with that. No. Right, well, let's stick with the Pringles for now. So we've had... Um... Why don't you eat another two? Just totally subconsciously. <laughs> you, took, you took three. Yeah. It'd be rude not Didn't to Didn't want them. to put them back in. Yeah. Right, here we go. These are... This is, uh, I think... What the fuck? Well? Buttered, buttered, buttered popcorn. Buttered popcorn flavoured Pringles. Popcorn flavoured Pringles. Oh yes, I've dug deep for these. Bloody hell, what I evil mastermind come up with these? Good God. <laughs> Can't okay. imagine these are going to be good. The smell's going to be amazing. And Jeez, not good. No. No. Did you get the whiff? Oh, it smells exactly like those buttered popcorn jelly beans. It'll be the same flavour, yes. won't it? No. That's what it's going to be in that. But on, with a right. Cheers. pringle texture. Oh, you've got, got one shard. this time. Yes. Yeah, I'm just taking a shard. Look, it's like the Batman symbol, it's not really. Mm. It's like the Heinz symbol. No. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine oh. if they were... No. No. Oh, they're weird. No. There no, is no, the no, same no, no, flavouring no. as in the jelly beans. Very similar. So it's weirdly sweet. Yeah. It has a really odd aftertaste of fake butter. If that makes sense. Chemical yeah, it has, butter. It has got a buttery yeah. something going on. Oh, I'm not, not convinced by those. No. They can go in the bin. Yeah. Literally, they're going yeah, in the bin. That's, that's, that's a waste of spuds. I'd, eat, I'd probably eat my way through those. Yeah. No, I, I would agree with that. Them. Well, look, why we wanna... I didn't mind them to the aftertaste, then it's... Ugh. I'm going to ask you to guess what these ones are. So. Uh, okay, I'm looking forward to this. Uh, so have a, have a half. I smell of cardboard. Well, cardboard tube. Go on. Yeah, it's probably all I'm smelling, actually. <laughs> yeah. It's the smell of tube. Oh, wait, there's something else now. Oh, God. Something vaguely seafoody, maybe. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah, I'm getting what it is. I oh! That. that ain't good. That's. Oh! That tastes like rancid seafood and cheese. What is going on? Want to make a hazard a guess? Ugh, expired prawn? Egg sandwich. Oh! -ho! <laughs> Egg sandwich. Do you know it kind of makes sense? Yeah. I'm getting now it. Now with the context, yeah. But no. Deeply unpleasant. That's just messed up, isn't it? Oh. I'd never have got that without the picture. Now I've got the picture, I'm thinking, right. oh yeah, egg sandwich, but... Right, here we go. I think you might that, have seen what these are. That's a stripy tube. Yeah, so we're talking sweet again. Yeah, they're butter caramel, because it says on the back. There you go. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, oh! Sweet crisps oh. is wrong. Yeah. This is going to be even sweeter than the last Off one, you isn't go. it? Be my guest. Wow. Thanks, man. Come on. Uh, I'm not going to like it. Mm. Butter caramel. Okay. 
It's better for me than the butter popcorn because yeah. the aftertaste isn't as bad. It hasn't got that weird butter Ooh. flavor. The aftertaste of these is like super cardboard. It actually tastes of cardboard. Once you've sort of sucked yep. off all that, so just bake the um, <laughs> the sweetness. <laughs> I'm very sorry, everyone. Very sorry. Yeah, it's left with the, the Pringles cardboard in it. Yeah. And that is my issue with Pringles, is once the flavours have gone, the what's underneath it, plain crisp, you can eat them. Yeah, they, they're all smashed, look. Oh, yeah. Someone's well, kind of but they are, they're better than, better than butter yeah, popcorn. Yeah, I'm still not convinced by this. The whole sweet crisp thing should be stamped out before it becomes a thing. Yeah. If not, so, what do we have? Well, what we have now is some more Pringles. Hey! It's the Pringles episode sponsored by Heinz. <laughs> sponsored by Crunch. <laughs> Crunch. Crunch. <laughs> God. <laughs> Sounds like a Harry Potter elf or something, doesn't it? The evil Crunch. Krampus. <laughs> Crunch, son of Krampus. <laughs> if you use the wrong sources, he takes them away and replaces it with Crunch. <laughs> but I wanted barbecue. Only Crunch for you. <laughs> Pouring crunch down your, your oh, chimney. God. <laughs> Staking you to the floor and pots. Shoving up your nostrils. I crunch you. No. I crunch you, boy. <laughs> right. Um, another flavour. I don't know if you've seen what these are. Probably says I have not, actually, no. Right, off you oh, go. This right. is savoury. Okay. I think. <laughs> That's not a good start, <laughs> is it? Might be savoury. Yeah. Might be wrapped. Oh, did you want to smell? Yeah. Oh, God. Or huff, as they say on Cheat Show. That's. That's unusual. That is unusual. That's almost sort of vinegary. Um, but with a weird underlying soy sauce type stuff. Very good. Oh, wow. Quite potent. Mmm. So sauce, barbecue, maybe kind of a hint of? Well, what it is, is some sort of weird noodle. Oh! Weird noodle flavour. 30th so. anniversary weird noodles. <laughs> They're the best. It's the 30th anniversary of weird noodles, everyone. <laughs> Get your weird noodles ready, guys. We'll cook them all together. Um, Yeah. Yeah, it's beef noodles, I would have said. Yeah. Have we got an briefly. app that translates oh, whatever language that may be? What is that, Malaysian? I don't... Automatic language detection. Oh, it's got it. Nice. All right, here we go. Yakisoba flavour. Yakisoba noodles. We did well it. Well done. We did it. Huh? You alright? Yeah. Alright, with that. Hey, you got some from Taiwan, so it might have been Taiwanese. Good boy. Ah, uh, yes. Have you seen what these are? Yakisoba. Um, they're pink. They're pink. Uh, they've got some sort of PlayStation advert on the top? Yes, they've got a PS4 advert on the top. Amazing. But, see if you can guess. Oh, is it Xbox flavoured? Yes! Oh, amazing. It's a taste of oh. microtransactions. It's Phil Harrison flavour. Oh, God, it's crab. Oh, spot Quite on. Obvious, yeah. Absolutely spot on. Yeah. Weirdly, look at the weird <laughs> image. Return to... your crab. Yeah. Of <laughs> I've got to take a photo of. Did you, when you were a kid, used to get your crisps and break them into pieces and make Britannia out of them? Yes. Yeah. Yes, I think every kid's done that so, yeah, absolutely. at some point in their life. So, uh, yeah, Britannia the crab. That's an odd one. Crab Britannia. We've got to bloody eat one now, haven't we? Yeah, let's do it. Let's crab it up. Right. <sighs> crab time. Never knowingly turned down a crab. They're really crabby. Oh, yeah, they are. That's a whole lot of crab. Mm. That is the chroma of Pringles. Fairly accurate. Yeah. Not not bad, but again, flavour goes soon. Mm. It's yeah, gone too. They're all right. I'd eat those, given yeah. that I'm not a big prawn cocktail fan. The prawn cocktail's an odd one. That's dangerously close to being very sweet, isn't it? Yeah, tasting mm. rather like crunch. <laughs> Which we still haven't eaten and possibly never will. <laughs> the mystery of crunch will always remain. <laughs> there we go. That's that's what this episode's called. It's the mystery of crunch. Indiana Jones and the mystery of crunch. So do we want to rank these? Best yeah. this end? What do we think? Right. Best. I'm going for the crab, actually, for the best. Really? Yeah, that was my okay. fave. Crab. Then, uh, uh, probably the yakisoba. Okay. I can't even remember what these ones were. The, oh, God. Oh, oh, egg I sandwich. Yeah, they, they can live in the bin. Um, <laughs> buttered popcorn's pretty bad. It's the yeah. sweet ones aren't doing That's, it for me. Yeah, and, but, and the caramel in there. Butter caramel. I, I oh, would... Isn't this butter caramel? Just butter and caramel mixed up? Yeah. 
Well, there, looking at it. There. That's weird. Uh, well, I, I would probably swap the crab and the meat pie, even though I wasn't a big meat pie fan. Mm -hmm. That's probably the one that I would eat out of all of those. Mm. So, there we go. Well. Pringles. Pringles. <laughs> right. Don't understand the tube disparity here. I thought they were yeah. all regulation stuff, but the height difference I can understand. Some are much wider than the others, and yes. small height differences. There's, there's literally... Do you think it's like... Because in Japan, things mm. like PS controllers are smaller, aren't they? I think. Oh, this is true, yeah. So is it something to do with that? that I people wonder. Around the world... And people do famously shove Pringles tubes up their asses. Yeah. So maybe if, it's, if they've been out in a territory longer, they think people's anuses have widened <laughs> enough through the use of Pringles tubes to be able to release so bigger what, ones. what we're saying is that Russians have big anus holes. Because of putting crab Pringle tubes up them. <laughs> Yes, yeah. they've evolved yeah. to have. As the, I believe uh, Putin repeatedly says at press conferences. P Putin. 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 <laughs> Putin. <laughs> Putin. <laughs> right, I think on that note, that's the Pringles. Bye! Strutty man.